Okay, as the rain starts to come down, we've got the two mile grade one Punchestown champion hurdle. Edwina Rum for Doug Warren is number one. Fit away for John Morgan is two. Supernova for Joshua Sutherland is three. Tower Heist and Kay Burley are four and five for Paul Rhodes. Six is Trades War, Trade Wars for Graham Clutterbuck. Seven, Soggy Bottom for David Robertson. And eight is Unlimited Power for Joshua Sutherland. So eight of them to around this course and the rain's teeming down. You're going to want to be a bit of a mudlark here. This time it's going well away. Wait for them to settle down. So go to the first of eight hurdles. This punches down champion hurdle, great one of it. I'm going to be led by Tower Hat. Heist with Soggy Boy on his outside. They're all very close here. There's a couple of links between first and last. They're not enjoying the rain. Has anybody noticed the jockeys look like uh, the guy out of Sin City that chops the heads off the girls? The jockeys' goggles. Has noticed that. But anyway, back to the race. It's Soggy Bottom that leads him over the second. He's in close order with Supernova. Out wide is Edwina Rum. It's the fence Tower Heist. Fidway a little wider. Limited power. Cape Burley and Trade Wars. So Soggy Bottom leads us. From Edwina Rum that now takes it up. For the first time Doug ever has a, a leader in a Grade 1 event. Leads over the third. They're all over it. A little bit sticky with Supernova. But it's still Edwina Rum. By a length now to Soggy Bottom. So the length back to Unlimited Power and Fidway out wide against the fences Tower Heist. And the length to Paul's other horse, Kay Burley, widest of all now. And then Supernova and Trade Wars as we go back towards the rail. So still over a mile to travel, and Edwina Rum's got a couple of lengths here. Down to the next of the hurdles. He skips over it well, as does the rest. Slow over it was unlimited power. The one that's really got towed off now is Trade Wars. It's probably something up with him. Bad luck there, Grab. Not going to win from there. So with a mile to go, it's Edwina Rum from K Burley Tower House. There he is, and he's getting pulled up for Trade Wars. I can tell who uh, the cameraman was on that one. We go over the fifth. He was interested in his own horse, but his. Ed, excuse me, Edwin will run from Tower Heist now. Draws alongside K Burley on unlimited power. And then Soggy Bottom and Fidway. So it's a bit two by two by two at the moment. And then Supernova just to the rear. So it's all change up front now as Tower Heist takes up from Edwin will run. And unlimited power following them through. Out wide K Burley. Soggy Bottom still there. Fidway's under a bit of pressure now. I'm trying to make up the ground. And Supernova's still got a lot to do. They go over the six, but better jumps there by K Burley and unlimited power jump themselves into one and two so k burley leads from unlimited power in second tower heist is three so he bottom is four edwin will run running on now is five fidway trying to make up some ground on the wide outside and supernova is nowhere but it's k burley that leads us by a length inside the final half a mile and it's k burley from unlimited power here comes fidway on the outside tower high still running through soggy bottom's not going to win from there they're over the penultimate k burley jumped it well but fidway's got away from it slightly better and draws alongside inside the final two and it's Kate Burley from Fitway out wide tower heist unlimited pounce between these four now inside the final quarter and it's Fitway and Kate Burley down to the last they jump it together they get away from it both together it's Fitway and Kate Burley these two are neck and neck as they get down to the furlong but Fitway just noses in front now can they fight back tower house on the outside but it's Fitway Fitway by half a length Fitway half a length to Kate Burley tower heist fighting back now is Kate Burley on the inside but Fitway hangs on to this from Kate Burley in second I think tower heist was third on the mid-power Fourth. There's a little bit of Wiener you know, Rum at the rear there. Another win for John Morgan. He's racking them up this week. So John takes it with Fidway. Second was Kay Burley and Tower Heist was third. All both for Paul Rhodes. Joshua Southern was fourth with I can't remember the name. <laughs> I'll wait for the card to come up. Fourth with unlimited power. And he also got fifth with Supernova, Josh Sutherland. So unlucky there for Trade Wars who uh, got an injury as he Race there, unlucky for Paul, um, for Graham, but he'll be back next week, I'm sure.